Good morning, Payton for Tiger. Today is October 24th, 2017. It's Pink Tuesday. Tuesday. My name is Kylie Jordan, broadcasting live from WPFD. Thanks for tuning in. It's a new day, Tigers. Let's take a moment to reflect on positive thoughts. Our Ivy Learn Profile Trait of the Month is inquirers. Inquiring learners strive to ask questions for understanding, approach challenges independently, persist despite obstacles, explore new possibilities with curiosity, and learn from new experiences. Have you earned any copy tickets this week? If not, it's never too late to start. The focus for this month is October is being courageous. Remember to drop them in the cartridge boxes located in the front office every day. Your name may be pulled for a treat or VIP access to the Lit Lounge. My name is Kylie Jordan from Mr. Coburn's fourth grade class. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge, pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Tuesday, October 24th, we will be having chicken nuggets with dinner roll, cheeseburger, great salad with dinner roll, cherub beans. Have you heard about the Jacket to Jacket reading program? No, tell me more. For the whole month of October, you will have a log to every book you read. Write down the number of pages, then ask your parent to sign off, it on, off on it. At the end of the month, your teacher will collect your book logs. The more pages you read, the more prizes you can win. Well, wow, that sounds pretty awesome. So all you have to do is read to win a prize? That's it. Read, write those pages, and don't forget your parent's signature. The best part of all is that everyone who participates wins a ticket to a Georgia Tech basketball game. Whose class do you think will read the most pages? I think it will be Mr. Neal's class. Or maybe Ms. Duster's class. So let's read, 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 to read, read tigers. tigers. It's time for a message from Principal Gunner. I wonder what book she'll be sharing with us this week. Let's check it out. Good morning, boys and girls. This is Miss Gunner again with some very special announcements. We have a lot going on this week. First is Red Ribbon Week. Miss Gunner, what is Red Ribbon Week? That is the time where we say no to drugs. It's also a time to remember that Peyton Forest is a place, a no place for hate. That means we don't like bullying. That means we love each other. We're kind to each other. So this week, Tuesday is Wacky Tacky Day. Wednesday is Tackle Drugs. That means you get to wear your favorite sports jersey. Thursday is Blackout Drugs. That means you have to wear all black because that's saying no to drugs. And Friday, OMG, is the Character Book Parade. Woo, I'm so excited. No Place for Hate Boys and Girls Red Ribbon Week. Guess what Tuesday is? Awards Day. Tuesday night, tell your parents, if you have A's and B's on your report card, you got to get your mom and dad and your auntie and your grandparents to come out Tuesday night, 6 o'clock, awards day. You get to walk across stage and get your certificate. I'm so proud of you. Friday, boys and girls, we're having the fall festival, the trick or treat. Really, I should say trunk or treat. There'll be candy. There'll be a haunted house. There'll be face painting. Oh my God, there'll be a jumping house. So much fun. Right after school on Friday, you have to come. You have to be here. You got to get your sign permission slip. And from 3 to 5.30 on Friday, we get trunk or treat. All right, boys and girls, attendance. Remember, we're coming to the end of the month. If you want that golden ticket, that golden ticket next week, you got to come to school every single day. Okay, boys and girls, look at where I am. If you are a third, a fourth, or a fifth grader, I want to know, are you a multiplication master? How do you get your name up here? If you master your twos, your name goes here. If you master your threes, your name goes here. If you master your fours, your name goes here. 
your name gets called and you get a multiplication master's lanyard you don't know you may come to the lit lounge so study those timetables i can't wait and my most favorite part is ar and reading reading is our superpower i have two books i want to tell you about the first one is the whipping boy let me tell you something this little boy in here he lives in a town where there's kings and queens and princes the prince is a is a boy in elementary school but there's a rule in this city that you can't whip or spank or hit any people who are kings or queens or princes. So guess what they do? They go find a little boy on the street, they take him to the castle, and every time the prince gets in trouble, he gets whipped. Ain't that something? But guess what? That little boy that gets whipped, he wakes up one day and he's stuck in the prince's dream. What is gonna happen? Will he keep getting whipped? Come and get this book and let me know. The other one is Juna B. Jones, First Grader at Last. I love Juna B. Jones. In the media center, there's so many about her, but this one is about Juna B. going to first grade. She's so excited. She runs in class. She sits down. She can't see what's on the board. OMG, she may have to get glasses. Tell me how Juna B. Jones at first grade is. I cannot wait. Boys and girls, who is leading in the AR contest? This past week, we had boys and girls going to the Lit Lounge with 15 or more points. Will it be you? I love you, boys and girls. Let's make it a great day, the Peyton way. This has been your news for today. Reporting from WPFA, the home of the Tigers. Thank you for tuning in. Remember to be kind, be responsible, and be the best you can be. Make, Make it a great day, the pay and way.